All right, hey Carmen, this is the bloomer all cleaned up. Pretty much been fully ran through. The only thing we haven't ran through yet on it is the LQ hasn't got his deep clean detail yet. It's just been kind of cleaned once out for pictures and stuff like that, but it'll get a deep clean on the LQ before you get it. Awning's been serviced. I mean, it shined up really good through the acid wash, so I think you'll be pleased. Up here in the LQ, I mean, again, it hasn't been deep clean, but it's still really clean for you guys. Um, you'll get your big pull-out drawers underneath your couches. And then again, some overhead storage. And then on your entertainment center, you'll have direct TV, your radios with your switches for your outside speakers, as well as your big storage cabinet. And then your upper storage out here with your outlaw book and all your remotes. Hat racks. You have all your cabinets. And I'm just showing you all this, Carmen, so you know all the doors latch effectively and have been ran through. Then your fold-out couch. I'll shoot up here in the bed real quick. You'll have a TV up there as well on its own direct. That pad right there is for once you lay the dinette down into a bed, that pad will make up the difference for what you're lacking. And then you'll have your house door as well. Um, your generator, right now it's running to power this whole thing, but right now it's got 253 hours on it. I assume it'll go up a few hours just us keeping this trailer charged up for you. And then of course, yeah, your awning switch and your hydraulic switches. This trailer is fully winterized right now. Um, but again, you'll have your convection, convection microwave combo, sink, all your drawers right here. And then your access to your under the sink to your hot water heater as well. And you have your fridge and your freezer, both gas and uh, electric. All your sensors have been run through. Um, pretty much the whole trailer has been serviced. You really won't have to worry about any operational stuff being wrong on this trailer. It's super clean. It's been ran through both our LQ shop and our chassis shop. Again, just waiting for that deep clean here. Toilet seat, your sink. Um, show you that these cabinets work good too. Then again, yeah, you'll see some green in the sink, but that's just because it's that winterization dripping out. Your big vanity cabinet. Then again behind me you'll have your big storage. There's also a table that you can put on a carpet base to slide around the inside of this trailer or outside if you want. Um, again, just some extra storage for you and some extra table space. Your big shower, your skylight. Again, fully winterized. And then I'll show you that this max air fan works really quick. And we'll step through back into the horse area. Again, it's been through acid wash. I thought it had cleaned up a little better on the worm than it did, but again, it's still really clean for a used trailer. Um, padded dividers, stud dividers. Your mangers, they have this really cool like hay cover on them, which I've never really seen before, but I think it's really cool to kind of keep your hay situated inside those mangers. Again, worm flooring. Uh, you'll have LED lights in here. You'll have drops on both sides of this trailer. Your side ramp, um, I know we talked about putting a latch on here, so your inside latch is going to be situated probably right there, or maybe just above that kick mat. And it'll be somewhere about right there on the outside of this trailer when we put that latch on here. And I'll drop all the windows to show you they work. So 
So all your windows, again, everything latches, everything on this trailer has been ran through, so you don't have to worry about anything. Tires are good, brakes have been checked, bearings have been packed. We got you all new Alcoa hubcap covers. Right here is that light we replaced. I told you we were waiting on a light. There's that new light that we replaced. We got it from Bloomer, so it matches the rest of this trailer. Again, your back tack, um, water tank, it's been cleaned out, it's ready to go. Generator's running, of course. Then you have your hay pod up top. Then again, your gas fill for your generator. You got your small drops inside the windows and then Bloomer does these cool doors where you can swing them open too on a gas piston. That way, again, you can feed super easy with these doors. Then your under manger storage. I'll show you these windows work and doors work. Your shore cords in your mangers. And the cool thing about this trailer is again, there's your feed door, but the cool thing I like about it is on this escape door, you actually have that manger that swings out as well. Um, so it gives you that feed space in the front as well, but it also gives you another manger storage underneath. So it gives you some cool storage options on this trailer. And of course, fold up step here, one on the front tack. Hot water heater's been serviced. Slide out's been serviced. All your plumbing's been checked out. Um, while I got you on this video, I'll point out some stuff. Just since I'm shipping it to you, I want you guys to know kind of how a couple things function. Um, your hydraulic jacks, you're gonna have duels. Your switches for those jacks, where they got them, this sucker are gonna be up above your fold down tray right here. You'll have a button for each one. Um, but the main thing I wanted to show you is your battery disconnect for this trailer. It's kind of hidden. It took me a while to find it since we have these big uh, marine batteries in here. It's situated behind these batteries. So right now it's on. You'll need that to be on to power everything in the trailer. And then again, shut that off if you're not using it for a while, just so your batteries don't drain. Um, your override for your hydraulic jacks, if for some reason those batteries do die, you'll have a little lever to stick it in there and you'll hand crank this trailer up if anything ever happens to it. So again, it's been fully ran through, fully serviced. Breakaway brake system's been fully serviced. I think you guys will be really pleased with how clean this trailer is. And again, since it's gonna be probably next week before we ship it to you guys, not only will that LQ get another deep clean, but I'll have them rewash the outside, rewash the inside, just make sure you're getting a top-notch trailer. Um, give me a shout if you have any more questions, thanks.